Good morning, East Texas Ground Jacket 46. At what's your name? Request uh, taxi for a northbound departure 2500 with whiskey. Is that a Jacket 46 calling? Yes, sir, Jacket 46. Jacket 46, East Texas Ground, runway 36, taxi via November, hold short of runway 31, departure frequency 127.32. And uh, stand by for squad. Okay, we'll taxi to 36 via number on hold short runway uh, 31. Stand by for squad, check 46. Okay, so we're going to taxi down to our one of our two runways here at this airport. Uh, I don't know if you can see this on the screen. We're going to go down to the south end of the airport, uh, but we're going to hold short of runway 133. Just off to uh, carry. Off to East Coast. I'd like to proceed on golf to the airport to 36 for fuel inspection. Ops 2, proceed via golf, hold short runway 36. See you hold short 36, Ops 2. So what we're going to do is take off out of East Texas Regional. We're going to fly north uh, up to the city of Longview. Just kind of circle around the town of Longview. Um, look at everything. We'll see campus along the way. And then um, we'll come back down into Longview for one or two uh, landings, just practicing landings. And we'll taxi back into Eterno. Quick 30, 25, 30 minute flight or so. Uh, nothing too much there. Hey, ground five up my And uh, we'll verify our four takeoff. Uh, go on to uh, KRS jet. Scout flaps prop. Zero five up my six ground. Proceed. Correction taxi via November Hulk. Avador is latched. All right, November Hulk. Okay. Three six five up my. Should be off the ground in about a thousand to eleven hundred feet today. Checking eight cross three one November taxi via November Mike. Definitely. One, uh, we should be climbing at a pretty good rate today, about 1,700 feet per minute. Jacket 46, runway 36, fly runway heading, clear for takeoff, wind 100 F4. Runway heading, clear for takeoff, runway 36, jacket 46. So we're clear for takeoff, we're going to turn our lights on. And final looks clear, the runway looks clear. Got a little bit of a right crosswind on this takeoff. Jacket 54, E6 tower, runway 36, clip the option. Outside video. One of the cool things about uh, flight training here at Turno, we have a pretty busy airport, so we get to work with ATC quite a lot. Um, then the airspace around us isn't too congested, so we kind of we're free to practice as we as we wish outside the area. But the airport environment itself is fairly busy, so that's good practice for us. Jack of 46, come on departure, good flight. Contact departure, Jack of 46. 46, circle to 31. Okay, thanks one. Uh, cross pipe at or above 3,000, cleared the RNAV 36, circle 31, basis one. Long departure, jacket 46, 1,500, climbing 2,500. Jacket 46, Columbia departure, radar contact, turn right heading 040. 040, zero, 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 jacket 46. So they're taking us a little bit northeast. Go this way, and I'm setting up the autopilot. The uh, Garmin Vionic suite has a very nice autopilot, but it works for us. Maybe reduce, reduce my pilot workload a little bit. After you turn students get good experience using it, uh, it trains us to understand complex avionics and stuff. I'll go ahead and turn it on, and now the autopilot's fine. The airplane. Uh, as I can, I control modes, and it it uh, does what I want it to. So we're climbing on up to 2,500 feet above the ground today. A good view of the uh, city of Longview off to our left. Underneath us, we've got uh, the Eastman Chemical Plant, the big industry here in Longview. And obviously, you can see the airport behind us. Two thousand Mac Roger. Secondary three. Turn correction, uh, contact tower. Over to tower, check in three. We're going to level up at 2,500 today, so I'm just going to set the airplane up for cruise. We're not going to run full power the whole time. We're going to bring the throttles back. Uh, we're going to run about 24 inches of manifold pressure with 2,100 RPM. 
Yes, helicopter, five tango extra, that traffic is at your seven o'clock. So normal training flights at Laterno, what we normally do is depart the, uh, the the area, go maybe 10, 10 15 miles away, okay. and we, we practice okay. flying airplanes, so that would consist of um, maneuvering the airplane around, practicing stalls, uh, flights at various speeds. Uh, we, we go to different airports around the area. We have four airports within about 25 miles at different little towns around the area, so we go out to those, we practice uh, arriving at an airport, we'll do landings, and then uh, we usually come back into Longview, uh, and we get to talk to approach, work with ATC, and we come in to land, uh, or we come in and do a couple landings in Longview, uh, just practicing our, our landing technique, uh, flying the airplane in what we call a traffic pattern around the airport, different things like that. Uh, so that's pretty pretty normal flight. We get to fly over all the scenery out here. It's pretty beautiful. Two land runway three six check at forty six. So I'm going to go ahead and lower our landing gear. You'll be able to see that in the video. Roger, below one forty. We're going to go gear down and making sure our avionics show that we have all three wheels down. There they are. I'm going to turn off the autopilot and just hand fly it in. We've got our prop set for right traffic. Our right right traffic landing to Barney Beach at 3 1. Right traffic landing to Barney Beach at 3 1. You can see the airport over on our right. I'm going to land on the north runway, the lighter lighter gray looking runway. 0111, that's 25. So the, well, this handle here is adding my flaps on the back of the wing. They add lift and they add drag. So they're going to help me slow down a little bit. Uh, along with they fly a steeper approach. So Jack we use those to come land. available. Check 46. Jack at 54, traffic no factor, runway 36, clear to land, and additional traffic, Seminole short final. Jack at 54 has the traffic in sight, we'll follow that traffic, clear to land on 36. Vandy 61, contact departure, good flight. What we do here, uh, this is one thing that we practice quite often, is landings. So we're coming in a nice, stable approach. We're learning how to set the airplane up on final. Get it slowed down from our 175 miles an hour down to uh, about 90 miles an hour is where we'll touch down at. Dealing with any wind that happens right now, I've got a little bit of crosswind from the right to the left. Here's down in three green. I'm just reducing the power to almost idle. I'm just flaring stall, airplane stall, out. Stall, 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 stall. Nice full stall landing, and then we'll get on the brakes gently. Slow us down. Tracking the flaps. We're going to open our cow flaps. Right, November contact, ground point six. Right, November ground point six, check, 46, good day. I want to thank you all for flying with me today on this short flight. A uh, little tour of what we do at Turno Aviation. Contact 54 is clear of 18 at November. Uh, Taxi now, what's that on?